Heavy water, or deuterium oxide, DAD2O, appears identical to regular water, but contains the hydrogen isotope deuterium instead of ordinary hydrogen. The key difference lies in the nucleus of deuterium, which contains a neutron alongside its proton, making it roughly twice as heavy as ordinary hydrogen. Heavy water plays a crucial role in certain nuclear reactors, where it serves as both a neutron moderator and coolant, slowing down fast neutrons to facilitate controlled nuclear fission. The CANDU reactor design from Canada specifically utilizes heavy water's unique properties, allowing it to operate with natural, unenriched uranium fuel, unlike most other reactor types. Scientists use heavy water and neutron scattering experiments to study the structure and dynamics of materials, as deuterium scatters neutrons differently than regular hydrogen. In biomedical research, heavy water serves as a non-radioactive tracer to monitor metabolic processes and study how water moves through biological systems. Nuclear magnetic resonance spectroscopy relies on heavy water as a solvent for analyzing organic compounds, as it doesn't produce interfering signals that would mask the molecules being studied. Producing heavy water is energy intensive and costly, typically requiring multiple stages of distillation or chemical exchange to gradually concentrate the naturally rare deuterium from ordinary water. Future nuclear fusion reactors will depend on deuterium extracted from heavy water as one of their primary fuels, offering the promise of abundant energy with minimal radioactive waste. During World War II, heavy water gained strategic importance when Allied forces executed daring raids to sabotage Nazi Germany's only production facility in Norway, significantly hampering their nuclear weapons program.